What's up guys? Uh, making a quick video for you this morning because I have a story for you. I have a story for you this morning. So, Gaines uh, ran away last night from my brother's house and so um, we've been out looking for them. But I got a phone call from the <laughs> U-Haul people, okay? So as you guys know, I'm moving to Florida this weekend. I, I made my reservation weeks ago. Okay, weeks ago. Everything went through, no problem, right? Like, everything's good to go. All right. Um, and then today, they called me and said, I can't make this up. They said, well, your, your truck's available at, at the Grand Haven store, but you're going to have to go to Spring Lake because their sister store has the auto transport. So you're going to have to go get that. The first words out of my mouth were, okay, hang on. <laughs> You're telling me that I'm paying you over $1,500 to use two pieces of equipment. One piece of equipment is seven miles away. The reason I put it in the Grand Haven store is because it's close enough to where I live so that I could literally walk down there so I wouldn't have to have another person go with me to get the trailer. I could just walk down there, take everything, and then drive it back the quarter mile to the house, but now I have to go get this. Even though it's at your sister store, which is the same owner as the Grand Haven store. Holy shit! That's the worst customer service I've ever heard of. Like. I pray to God you do not send me a review after I get done using your shit. Please, for the love of God, do not send me a review form. Like, it's seven miles. You have employees. Hell, even if you don't, get off your ass and drive down to your other store and convenience your customer. Is it just me or is that like the worst? That's literally the worst customer service I've ever heard of. Like, how are you in business? Well, and you know what his response is? Well, that's just the way it is. That's the way it is. So next time I'll call budget. That's the way it is. Have a great day.